The Lake Shore's crops are diverse, from asparagus in the spring, pumpkins in the fall. And now, there's a facility in Muskegon County that's described as a launching pad where crops can be processed or packaged and sent to customers around the world. Here's 13 on your side, Lake Shore reporter John Mills to explain. The 8,000 square foot food, agriculture, research and manufacturing center is located right here on the campus of Muskegon Community College. For short, just call it the farm, a launching pad for food businesses. No startups here. This site is targeting businesses that already exist and need space to scale. We have brew, bottle and ferment. Uh, kombucha tea. Zach Smith's kombucha business will be the first tenant. In two years, Smith hopes to outgrow this space. We're distributed through Cherry Capital Foods and we're in stores all throughout Michigan. From here, Smith expects to reach beyond the state line. The farm is also a space where large food businesses can pilot test new products or quickly jump on new food trends. This is designed for fruit and vegetable. Marty Gerenser is the executive director for the West Michigan Food Processing Association. The effort to build this facility started in 2015. It was made possible in part thanks to a $2 million State of Michigan MEDC infrastructure grant. Other partners include the Community Foundation for Muskegon County, Muskegon Community College, and Michigan State University. Farm is a step towards more fully incorporating the food processing sector into the region's economic development strategy. And it's an accelerator. It's beyond an incubator. It's for those who have been in business for a few years, have, got, have some gross revenue. And beginning this fall, this facility will offer STEM-related education programs to high school and Muskegon Community College students. In Muskegon County, John Mills, 13 on your side.